Michael Nunes here from Banana Hobby. Welcome back to another episode. This is going to be a quick assembly of the Flyfans J20, so we're going to get the show on the road. Before we start, we're going to insert our wing tube, and you'll notice you might think you're missing a hole. There's tape that's put on here to protect it from painting and the wires, so just get an X-Acto knife, peel it back, open it up, and exposes your wing tube and your connectors. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and grab our bag of goodies with our six screws and let's get on with the montage. All right, everybody, last part we're going to do is the rudder. Just so you know, on the rudder, it's the decals facing out. On the inside of here, you'll notice that there is a grub screw. Both sides have them on the inside. And basically what's going to happen is the spindle is going to go down and that grub screw is going to attach right here. You'll notice right here on the servo arm, there is a little nub. And that nub is going to go right here in this channel. Too easy, right? So all we're gonna do is we're gonna take our rudder. We're going to push her in, make sure she goes in that slot. We're gonna align, get that grub screw. We're gonna turn it, tighten it down, and that's it. Very easy, guys. We'll go ahead and turn it. We're gonna go ahead and do the other side and we'll be right back. Well, y'all, that's it. Six screws plus the two grub screws gets her done. She looks as good as she flies, y'all. Now, at the time of this video, this jet, the J20 from Flyfans, is only $5.29 here at Banana Hobby. The link's down in the description. This jet, she flies great, y'all. She's also pre-wired for electric brakes. So if that's something in your repertoire, go ahead and check this out. The link's down in the description. Thanks for joining us. Noon's out.